bring it back. What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's Lambo back with another video for you guys. Um, I'm going to say skip ahead uh, to those who don't want to hear me talk for a little bit, um, but I just wanted to say thank you guys so much for the stream last night. Um, if you don't know what I'm talking about, just go back and rewatch it. I, I still am kind of like speechless on it. I, I just really want to say I appreciate every single one of you guys that watches the videos and that, uh, that likes or comments or that just supports me in any way. Last night was truly a night I will I will never ever forget and it's going to be remembered like like I said I'll, I'll never forget it so I'm going to remember it for the rest of my life and I just I cannot thank you guys enough for um for your support and everything that you guys have been doing for me and I hope that uh that continues and I hope we can uh spread this community and and expand it even more which is which is awesome but uh make sure you guys hit that like and subscribe button i'll have another video like talking about everything and as well as that stream highlight specific video um later down the road and then also i want to say i apologize trip to the hall episode 9 will be coming out tomorrow not today um the reason for that is just because this new promo came out and i have finals this week so i only want to do one video at a time otherwise i would be doing two uh, so I genuinely do apologize for that. But without further ado, let's talk about walk the stage because that is what is that's what's important, man. That's what everyone wants to do is get these 298 100 power players. Um, so the reason you're going to want these guys is one because they these cards are going to go for a million plus coins. Like I said, they're 98 overall. They're 100 powers. Also, you're going to be able to cherry in each of these cards for four madden max badges each which is really really cool really going to help you guys out toward getting a madden max player so we have we have the guide here man this is what we're going to do so we're we're going to be able to get both of those players here i don't know actually if we're going to be able to get both of them we'll have to see i don't think there's enough time um, but you guys should be able to get one so basically what happens is they have sets over here in the bottom bottom left over here right and so, yeah, like I said, you're going to need 25, 85 plus road to the draft players and 250 draft gems. The draft gems shouldn't really be hard to get. It's the 85 plus players you're more going to be concerned with. And then the so there's the 33 and 11 for the two players. And then um, this is basically, you know, you can exchange draft gems for hats if you so for so desire. But you're only going to get one um, hat per 25 gems. And then um, you can trade in draft gems for a 85 plus player as well, which is cool. So how you guys get the gems and the hats is you are going to be able to play this blitz event right here, which is 70 stamina, the 70 like specific stamina, which is cool. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to auto that and it should give you five hats each time is what it should do, which is awesome because that enables you to play the uh, the events. Or sorry, sorry, sorry. You only get you only get five hats the first time you play it. So, um, yeah, you only get five hats the first time you play it, and then you get to pick anywhere on this board that um, that you get to pick anywhere on the board. You get to redeem whatever you want. They're all going to be the same. They're kind of just random. And if you go into sets, I'll I'll explain here. I'll open one up, and then we'll do like four others, just so we can um, get that out of the way there. So we just get an 80 plus player right there. Well, just an 80 overall, which is perfectly okay. But basically, if you go into sets and you scroll down here, you're going to see these pickums, and it's five plus or less than uh, five cornerbacks, you know, quarterback or any other position for the number one draft. And if you get a pickum trophy out of those out of those events where you have to use your hats, um, you're going to be able to complete one of these sets. And the that's the only way is a pickum trophy. Or if you spend um, Madden cash in the store, that's another way you're also going to be able to get it. Enter rewards here. Obviously, you have the scheme selectable Julio Jones and then Jamal Adams. And then you have all of these. Um, so you have number 10 pick, number two pick, um, number three pick, four, five, six, you know, and so on. I just pulled this one, the 21 to 32. So that's the one I have right now, which is okay. You know, I definitely want a number two, number three, number four, or a five or six. You know, that'd be really cool. Uh, there is an achievement where you get 200 road to the draft points if you complete the draft board it resets daily at 10 30 a.m eastern so keep that in mind i'm gonna pull the rest i'm gonna try and redeem some here see if we can get a little lucky and we don't right there unfortunately unfortunately we don't get lucky right there uh let's go bottom left down here i feel like i feel like that's not actually i feel like that's not gonna be a good one we should go 
We should go right here. This one right here. I feel like I feel lucky with that one. I feel lucky. Okay, maybe not. Maybe not, man. But yeah, the draft is pretty, pretty simple, pretty self-explanatory. Um, I think the the hardest thing is just going to be how you know how do you get the gems, or sorry, how do you get the hats to be able to um, to be able to really get the uh, the eighty-five plus players and get the good stuff out of this pack is mostly what everyone's going to be concerned with. And I understand that because, frankly, I don't really have much of an answer right now. Um, we're just going to keep redeeming these, and hopefully we get something pretty cool. Like, okay, we get an 83 overall there. Not terrible. Um, but, yeah, I'm pretty sure the only way to get extra stuff like that is literally just to do it in the uh, in the store. Should give you some hats and things like that. Wait, what? Do we even get anything out of that? Do we even get anything? I don't know. Anyways, um, but yeah, you only get hats on the first time you do the blitz, which kind of sucks. Other than that, um, I'm pretty sure like it's random. Like it'll give you hats maybe if if you get lucky. Other than that, there's really not much to do. Like I said, if you spend a thousand gems, you get two draft hats, five draft gems, and then three eighty plus overall road to the draft players. And then obviously, if you spend Madden cash, you're gonna get more hats and and fun stuff like that. So. Um, it's completely up to you guys on how you guys want to utilize that. There is is a coin pack. It only gives you one 85 plus player and two 80 plus players, which honestly is worth it because those 85 plus players are going for quite a bit of coins right now. I'm pretty sure you'd be able to make money off that pack, to be completely honest with you. But that's basically it, man. There's really not much else to say. Make sure you guys are doing that Blitz event because that's the only way you're going to be able to get the hats and all that fun stuff. You're going to need 25 85 plus players to be able to get these guys which is pretty insane. Uh, if, you, if you ask me, it's pretty crazy. I, I've, I'm probably going to go for, I don't know. I don't know who I'm going to go for. I feel like these cards are going to be a little bit harder to get than, than what people think. I could be wrong on that though. 25, 85 plus players just seems like a lot and you're going to be getting quite a bit of coins to be able to get those in my personal opinion, because it's going to be kind of hard to to get 25, 85 plus players. But um, pick the right selections on the draft board. Make sure you guys are clearing the right things off right there. Um, not too big of a, an achievement to clear off the whole board. So I don't think it's the most important thing in the world to do. But you're also going to get better cards and um, pick ems when you when you play the more the more you do. So uh, that's basically it. Uh, there's 24 uh, things on the board. Make sure you guys clear them as much as you can. There's the Blitz event. There's the two Masters. You can exchange them for Mad Max badges, or you can probably sell them for like a 1.2 mil. Uh, it's completely up to you guys. Other than that, like I said, not really much uh, about the, the promo itself. Uh, I do want to say thank you guys for the stream last night. Once again, I'm not going to make this video over 10 minutes. I'm not going to give you guys ads in the middle of the video. I know you guys don't want that. I've, I've done, I think I've done it like twice in a row now, so I think I'm going to cut the video here. Um, let me know what you guys think of the promo and how you guys are um, planning to get these cards. I'm really interested to hear. But other than, yeah, like I said, man, very simple, pretty self-explanatory. You got to do what you got to do. You got to get the hats, got to get the gems, got to get 25, 85 plus players. So thank you guys so much for watching the video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.